Welcome back everyone, this is Joshua Lead and Iron, and we have a very special unboxing video today. This video is sponsored by Toner, and they had sent us over a microphone. I have used a Toner mic in the past, I've had the TC777, and it produced great sound. Really happy with it. So now they sent over the TC30, which just by looking at it, like in pictures and stuff, very, very nice. And when I heard it, because I've also watched like other YouTube channels, I'm always looking for like the best quality, the best bang for your buck, especially when you're starting out. When you're first starting to stream or do YouTube or create content in any form, or even just want to increase the professionalism in your system, sound, and of course, you know, visuals really make a big difference, but normally those come with very big price tags. What I want to do is be able to bring you guys that crystal clear audio sound, especially in this video, where you can just spend upwards of like $50 right around, but still maintain quality and also something that looks great. This is why we're here today. Anyway, thank you Toner for sponsoring this video. I truly appreciate it. And I'm pretty sure those that watch this video really appreciate it because we get to get the chance to hear a quality product that is not hitting our pocketbook. And I think that's a big, great big deal right now, especially how things are coming about. <laughs> so we're gonna unbox this and then we're gonna see exactly, exactly what uh, we're working with here. Then we'll also take this and hook it up to my PC and connect to Audacity or something that will be able to hear the audio that comes out of this microphone. I'm 100% sure that this microphone is going to look and sound great. I have zero doubt that it will not sound anything less than quality. Like I said, I have had toner mics in the past and they've always sounded good. The last one I had was a TC777. It was really easy to set up. There wasn't like any drivers or anything I had to you know, download or anything like that. So the experience I've always had with toner is a positive one. Anyway guys, let's get started, huh? Whoop. So I do have this overhead camera. I am working on getting a better like overhead system in due time guys it's gonna happen so just kind of bear with me with this one i know it's not like the greatest but we'll grow together shoot get this cut this open don't want to cut myself we'll cut this bottom open right here so toner reached out and wanted to get my honest opinion on their microphone okay so this is that Here's the microphone you can already tell the tc30 just by looking at the picture looks great I haven't even pulled it out of the box yet and it looks great. So I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull this out. We're gonna to toss that off to the side. So here's the mic. I think it looks great. From my understanding, it's very easy to set up. It's just a quick, you plug your USB-A into your PC or your or even your gaming console like a PS5. I don't think it works on Xbox. It can work on laptops. It can even work on your iPad as long as you have like the right connector for it. It does need an adapter, so keep that in mind. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up right here. And open this part up right here. So what we're greeted with is privilege support card. So it's a hundred percent, it's your key to hundred percent protection. They do have 24 months extended warranty. So that's, that's amazing. Two years and they have VIP exclusive discounts, priority customer support, and you can return just up to 60 days. Just having this card and then this mic. Our instruction manual comes in English, Dutch, French, Italian, Spanish, and Netherlands. So this is why it's so, so large, but it just kind of gives you accessories and what you have to do for like Mac and stuff like that. So that's the paperwork. And already looking at it, it looks very sharp. I like it. The colors are black and gray, has a little bit of gold into it. It's really nice. And let's pull this out. Okay, that's cool. Wow, this is kind of heavy. So these, these legs are 100% other than the bottom of the feet, of course, but they are, it's fully metal. And it looks like you can take these off. Okay. Looks like you can put this on a boom arm as long as you have, you know, normally they have like the larger connector for it. So you can put this on a boom arm if you were to buy one. I think they have one, I think it's like $40 that's made for this mic. Man, this is, build is pretty quality so these snap in place they're very sturdy they have rubber feet on them so it doesn't like slide around everywhere this has to come this way so this is a cardioid pattern so what that means is it is focused around here and it blocks out everything else okay 
Okay, another thing we have is our USB-C to USB-A. So this is USB-A, so it's pretty much found anywhere. You can get adapters for USB-C, you can get adapters for 3.5 millimeter, you can get adapters for lightning, you can get a lightning, yeah, a lightning port adapter for that as well if you're on Mac. And we have a pop filter where the base of this is metal. Very well built, very sturdy. And it looks like it just slides in here. Move that to the side. So I don't know if you guys can see that. It's like, it's like slides right up in here. And it's probably gonna click into place. Put this microphone down a little bit. Clicks right into place and I think that's it. There's nothing else in this box. It's empty. That's what comes into this in this microphone. Set that to the side. So all we are left with is this USB-C to USB-A and this microphone that looks very sharp. Wow, guys. So this is a very nice mic. The body of this is plastic. The feet are metal. And where you can connect it to a boom arm is also plastic. And here we have just our USB-C connector and I'm going to tell you guys this is going to look very sharp on any desk that you guys put this on. Quality looks great. Like I said it does click into place right here so that's clicked into place. It's not going anywhere. You got to really tug on that to get that out. Let's pull this mic out. Okay there's some glue or something right here. Oh, that's kind of a heavy mic. You can tell that this is really, really nice quality. Oh, this is really nice, guys. Like, it's kind of heavy up top here. I wish I could take this off to see how this mic looks inside, but that's fine. Completely not necessary. So let me put this back in. Mic looks great. Goes right back in, no problem. It's suspended, so you don't get any interference with the case around it. That slaps right back into place. And then you use this to control how it faces to you. There we go. Right in front of my mouth. So what I'm gonna do now is we're going to turn this off and I'm gonna bring you guys back after I'm done setting this up. I have my Mac here. I wanna put it on Audacity and, and show you guys how easy it is to go from Mac to PC. Anyway guys, I'll be right back. This has been a Toner Mic unboxing so far. And so far, I am pretty impressed. Toner, you guys are doing a great job. This is a very sharp looking microphone. I'm sure it's gonna sound great. So the reason I agreed to showcase their microphone is because I've had a Toner Mic and still have a Toner Mic, the TC777, and it blew me away. It sounds great. It was very light on the pocketbook. It connected without having to download drivers and put all these extra filters on it and stuff like that to make it sound good. It just sounded good right out of the box. And I also wanted to show you guys that you can get quality mic without having to really, really dig into that pocketbook. Some of this stuff can get really expensive. I'm super glad for a company like Toner that makes really, really high quality stuff without breaking the bank. Anyway, guys, I'll be right back. All right, so. One of the things I like to do, especially for longer cords like this, is just put a tie in. And this is because, helps me roll it up a little bit faster. And let's plug this in. And plug this in here. We'll plug this into the back of our microphone, like so. Plug this into my MacBook Pro, actually. So it's, uh, it's Mac OS. So I'm gonna go into settings, I wanna show you guys that my microphone is connected to my MacBook. And as you can see, the toner mic is selected. So now I have to do is go into QuickTime. So I'll hit new audio recording here. Then I'm gonna hit record. Okay, so everything from this point on is going to be just a toner mic. It was that easy to set up. All I did was plug it in. It populated. I didn't need to download any drivers. Very simple. And as you can see, this is the sound that is coming from straight out of the mic. I had zero things to change. And now we're just talking straight off this microphone. What I like about this microphone is it looks sharp. It's a very nice, very nice looking microphone. The pop filter, pop, 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 pop. The pop filter seems to be working okay, works great. What I really liked about this is it was so easy. It was so easy to set up. 
this is probably one of the easiest mics I've ever set up. Plug and play. When they say plug and play, literally plug and play. So far from my understanding, it sounds great and is all under, it's under $50 guys. Like this is, if you're starting out and you want to stream or you want to do voiceovers or even if it's just for meetings and stuff on Zoom and whatnot, this is going to be it. But it's really close to my Deity mic. I am going to probably set this up for a few streams. Not quite sure. I did want to get a boom arm for it or I can just use the boom arm that I have here. But what I'll do is I'll set it up and then stream from it and we'll see. But like I said, Toner makes quality products. Toner, their microphones have always been quality sound. There's no like hiss or anything like that. I'll even stay silent for a little bit, see what it picks up. And as you can see, it really didn't pick up a lot of noise. I didn't see a lot of movement like on my screen. There's a little bit, just like ambient noise, but for the most part, this is the sound that you're gonna expect. This is really nice, very clear audio. I'm not super close. I don't feel like I have to yell. And I know just by looking at my audio recording right here, that my levels are good, just straight out of the box. If there's anything that you guys want to know about this microphone, literally easy to set up. It came pretty much built. All I had to do was add this pop filter onto the top here and it's ready to go. Sturdy legs, doesn't make any like hissing noises or anything like that when you connect it. Very clean audio quality. This is probably the new budget King microphone. I've tried using my headset microphone not as good. I bought that Deity microphone, really good mic microphone. I've tried using my AirPod Pro microphone. I've tried numerous mics and still this microphone sounds, I'm, <laughs> I'm blown away by this microphone sound. The quality sound is coming from this like the first time I checked it when you guys saw. I was so surprised. I was like, there's, there's no way this microphone sounds like this. It's very, very, very good. And I really wanted to let you guys know if you guys are really just starting out it's very expensive it's a very expensive niche to get into whether it's streaming whether it's you know creating a channel you want that good audio you want that quality audio where there's not a lot of background noise and your voice sounds very crisp and clear it starts getting expensive and if you can save some money especially when you're buying quality products such as this toner tc30 why not this sounds amazing I'm not gonna touch it up with anything. There's no need for it. I don't have to have filters put on here. There's no need for it. What you hear is literally what's coming out of the box. So that way it gives you guys an idea what to expect, what kind of build quality, very sturdy, what kind of audio quality. You can tell that they take pride in providing you guys just quality products. And this is why it was so easy to say, heck yes, I'll do this video. I, I know what kind of quality you guys put out. It's short of amazing. Anyway, guys, if videos like this help you in any way, whether if you're just trying to find great quality stuff on a budget and it helps you reach your goals, please let me know in those comments. Please like this video so I can bring you more content like this. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go test this out on Twitch, I think, here in a couple days. And then we'll do a follow up with this microphone with those clips from Twitch and see how it performed in the gaming community. As you can see in like the content creation community right now, the YouTube community, this sounds great for podcasts. This sounds great for voiceovers. Now I wanna take it over and to another level and try it on Twitch to see how it, how it shows up. All right, we're gonna wrap up this microphone video. Very great sound. I think we need a boom arm. What do you guys think? Should I put this on a boom arm? Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, guys, I'll talk to you guys later, but I gotta go. Cause my back hurts.